High school football has been given the green light to go this spring with some specific safety protocols in place. All players must take a weekly COVID-19 test. However, each week testing is delayed. Teams may miss out on a game. KCRA 3's Michelle Dapper has more on how Eldorado Union High School has taken the rapid approach. The sun is out and we're out here playing football and uh, th things are definitely looking optimistic. We've been uh, cooped up in there. I've been doing home workouts and stuff like that, so it's good to get back out here. Let's go. It's all systems go for the start of the high school football spring season, and the Oak Ridge Trojans are off and running under head coach Eric Cavalier. I know everyone out here is super thankful for Coach Cav. As the COVID cases continue to shrink, the safety protocols remain in place. We all have masks. We're wearing masks in the huddle. When we get up to the line, then we can take it out to get a breather. Uh, we got bags out. Um, we're trying to keep social distance as much as possible. Try to uh, stay six feet apart and uh, we're not doing any close contact. We got to keep the shields in between us so we can limit our exposure. With a path clear to return, one of the state requirements involves weekly testing. El Dorado Union High School District took the proactive approach. We immediately went to work. You know, that's our duty we feel as a district is to provide opportunities for kids. From the get go, um, you know, they have looked for ways to get us back onto the field. They, they haven't looked for ways to keep us off. With the game clock ticking, they've lined up drive through parking lot antigen testing for all schools in the district. Identified resources that we could utilize to get the testing up and going. And here we are testing this Saturday so these guys can practice in full next week. If a test comes back positive, that's when the real research begins. If we have a student test positive uh, who's an athlete, obviously they'll go through the contact tracing process. They're going to want to know if, if, if there's anybody without a mask inside a feet more than 15, inside of six feet for more than 15 minutes. But the Trojans aren't taking any risks as their game plan is designed to play. Been waiting a whole year to get back on those Friday night lights, so. Don't expect the stands to be packed on a Friday. It's immediate family only. They'll also clear out the stadium between the JV and varsity games on game day. At Oak Ridge High School, Michelle Depper, KCRA 3 News.